Uh, the breadth and depth of the outpourings of grief and tributes to Paul Goggins uh, are a testament to the integrity and standing of the gentleman. Yeah. And uh, I'm sure other honourable and right honourable colleagues on, on these benches will want to add their own personal tributes. Uh, can I join with the Secretary of State uh, in thanking Dr. Haas and Megan O'Sullivan, and also thank our own talks team. The Right Honourable Member for Lagan Valley, uh, Jonathan Bell, Junior Minister in the Office of First Minister and Deputy First Minister, and the Reverend Mervyn Gibson, who put in many hours over the holiday period, along with others in other parties, to try to take, make progress. Can I welcome what the Secretary of State has said in her statement? She will know that under the terms of reference, it was for the parties themselves to come to an agreement uh, on a set of recommendations. And at the final plenary, four out of the five parties said they could not support the final draft from Dr Haas in full. But it remains a necessity to try to make progress and for agreement to be reached among the parties in Northern Ireland. And in our view, substantial progress has been made, although we are not there yet, and there remain significant problems in certain areas. But as we have heard from the Honourable Gentleman from Tewkesbury, these issues have been around for many, many decades, if not centuries. Can I welcome what the Secretary of State has said about uh, the need to continue the process through uh, uh, talks between the parties, and can she ensure that she will do everything possible to ensure those parties have indicated an unwillingness to continue to talk to try to resolve problems, that they will come back to the table and join with the rest of us in trying to move Northern Ireland forward? I can certainly give, it, give him that assurance. Um, it's, I think it's welcome that the, the DUP have signalled very strongly, although they have reservations about aspects of the Haas proposals, uh, there is much in them that they can support, and they do want the process to continue. And of course, as the largest party in the executive, um, they will be crucial in taking these matters forward. And um, like um, the member for North Belfast, I'd like to thank not only Dr Haas and Professor O'Sullivan, but all the participants in the working group. Um, at one stage, Dr Haas told me rather wearily that he had not appreciated that politicians in Northern Ireland were quite so nocturnal. Uh, there was certainly a, a lot of all-night sittings, and so the stamina of all those taking part is, is much to be appreciated.